What's up guys, welcome back to the Pioneer Series here on The Herd, and if you're new to this channel, thank you so much for checking it out, I really appreciate it. You haven't missed too much, uh, we're still in the early stages of making this town, and hopefully what will be this entire map we'll be able to make something out of, but right now we have just laid a couple um, roads, and we have a pizza parlor that's not in service right now, but that is being worked on okay well it's being worked on but today what we're working on is some farm fields uh we've already got one field over there in the yard we're gonna put another field today right next to it uh we still haven't built our farm but we're getting all of the fields that we need in place now and just so i can give you some context in terms of where we are on the left is where we have our machine shed and things like that there's a greenhouse over there on the left as well this is what we call the yard. It is where we put all of our municipal building uh, buildings and, and town owned equipment, and things like that. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna start by clearing out some of these trees. That way we have enough money or have enough room, should I say, to, to drive around and make this field. Now with that out of the way, we are gonna go back to the garage, drop this off get a mower and mow around this pasture. That way you can collect some more silage bales. Again, I know we're gonna get cows, but I know we're also gonna have a ton of silage that we're not going to need. So we might be able to sell some of this back and actually make some money after spending, I don't know, close to 2 million, I guess now, right? And now as we mow this field, I will just keep it here to show you the size of the field as we turn. On the right, you see all the silage bales that we've collected. Obviously, they're silage now, they're done fermenting. So we can take them somewhere and sell them, but we're waiting to get um, some cows and get some animals so that you know we'll be able to, to use the silage. But for now, it's just money that's sitting there that we don't necessarily need right now, but it's gonna come in handy in the future. And now if you have any idea what we should put in this field, please let me know. I said that the last time and you guys came back with sugar beets. And I thought, you know, yeah, obviously you're going to say something that's going to be a lot of work, right? No, we need sugar to run this town. I guess I'm so naive how much sugar you actually need to run a community. Now, as we finish up mowing this, uh, this plot of land here, I will just share with you a couple of the things that are on the horizon here with this series first we, we don't have a farm we need to build a farm and i think what i want to do is i want to put the farm over where we had our old town in the first of these series um just a, around the corner if you're new to this to this channel but uh, i'd like to put the farm there and i'd like to grow this farm to be a pretty good sized farm because we're going to be feeding a lot of people now inside the municipal building over here at a place we like to call the yard and there we are going to drop the mower. Go down the aisle a little bit at the very end if you can see we've got a wind rower. I'm gonna take that back to the field. Wind row all of the grass that we just cut so that we don't spend an eternity over here in this field. And I'll get back with you when we're over in the field. Now over here in the field wind rowing it and it's quite the size i like the size of of this field here i uh, will be able to do a lot and you ask my you ask why are you just not going to combine the two fields well diversity is the name of the game here especially since we're the only farm in town right now especially since we need so many other things to run this place uh we're gonna need a little bit of everything All right, now we are getting close and approaching the end of the wind rowing job. From here, we're gonna grab the baler and we're gonna bail all of this up. And then we are going to wrap all of this up into silage and put it over there next to all those other white marshmallows over there in my field. And here we are, as promised, bailing all this grass. I wasn't lying to you. Okay, we got to do this and then we got to wrap it into silage and then I'm telling you, we're probably going to end up selling a lot of this for money. And as you can see, a decent haul, especially for grass that we didn't plant. It's meadow grass, I think they call it. Basically grass that came with the map that hasn't been fertilized, that hasn't been anything. Uh, 
I can't, you know, I can't hate it. Back in the shed, and I'm never going to tell you that I'm an amazing driver when it comes to backing things up, but, you know, I'm trying my best over here to not scrape the side of that uh, tether, and we're in. There we go. Look at that. Now we're going to grab this wrapper. We're going to go back to the field, wrap up this hay, and call it a day. And as we finish this field off and wrap more of these giant marshmallows, I just wanted to say thank you guys for checking out this video. Like and subscribe if you haven't already, if you enjoyed the video. It really helps get this video out to more eyeballs, so really appreciate everybody's support on that. And until uh, the next time, I'll talk to you then.